Well, a question for you now at five. How often do you check your cable bill? There's a little known secret that cable and satellite companies, they raise their fees at the start of the new year. You better call Harry Explains in today's Consumer Reports. Back when you signed up for cable, hopefully you got a promotional rate. But if you're like most people after that, you probably moved on and never looked at your bill. You need to look at your bill. If you subscribe to AT&T's DirecTV or UVerse, Spectrum Internet, or Xfinity Cable or Internet, here's a surprise from Consumer Reports. It's becoming an annual thing for companies to raise prices on TV and Internet service. They blame the increases on rising programming costs and faster broadband speeds. AT&T customers who have DirecTV and UVerse TV service should see an increase by now. Same thing for some charter customers with Spectrum Internet. And yes, Comcast too. $4.50 a month for broadcast fees and a $2 bump for regional sports networks. Several companies are also reinstating data caps that were suspended during the early days of the pandemic. With data caps, you get a certain amount of data with your monthly plan. If you exceed that amount, then you could get hit with overage charges or you might find that your download speeds are slowing down. But there is one bright spot. A new law now in effect requires cable and satellite TV companies to disclose the total monthly price of your bill when you sign up. The law also bans those companies from charging you rental fees for equipment like a router. But even that new law isn't stopping the shift. A survey found that 27% of Americans will be cutting the cord by the end of this year. I'm Better Call Harry with your Consumer Reports. Harry, thank